Okay, on deck well. Been coming to Greenwood maybe seven years. I'm really grateful for how Greenwell's work has allowed me to access my unconscious. I'm aware that there are resources in my unconscious that are extremely valuable. And so when I have any kind of problem, I just go to bed, sometimes with an intention, sometimes not, and assume that my dreams will help tell me the answer or my unconscious will deal with it for me and tell me what to do. So I'm greatly appreciative of being there. Would you care to say anything about this particular process, the almond process? And as, as oh. it's... Yeah, well, what attracted me first to the almond process, other than my curiosity, was uh, the fact that it uses ORID, the process that we teach facilitators, the O stands for objective, you get out the objective data first, what you see, the experience through your five senses. The reflective has to do with feelings, and getting deeper, in my way of thinking, uh, and it's an intermediary uh, between the objective and the interpretive, which is therefore, what does this mean? The common, most common approach is I see something and then I immediately interpret and skip any more objective data or any reflection process. And then other people do the same thing and so we have our own opinions and it's not easy to come to any kind of consensus or understanding. And this has I can identify these four elements in the, in the Omen DreamWorks process. And then the fourth one is either action or decision. So then what? Okay. Okay.